Wiesel II family of armored vehicles was developed by Rheinmetall Defense for the German Army, Bundeswehr. It comes from the Wiesel I armored weapons carrier, AWC. The first Wiesel II airlifted light armored fighting vehicle was launched in June 1994. The engine was changed to a 1.9L Volkswagen inline four-cylinder turbo diesel with direct injection and intercooler, delivering 109 horsepower, 81 kilowatts, coupled to the ZF automatic transmission. The Wiesel II is generally larger, faster and more powerful than the Wiesel I, with advanced features for crew protection such as enhanced armor and air conditioning systems and NBC protection. Target acquisition is accomplished, either by the hard radar, which downloads target data via a radio data link to the Ozelot weapons platform or by the Thales, formerly Pilkington, Optronics Adad Passive Infrared Search and Track System, IRST, mounted on the roof front. For target tracking, the Ozelot is equipped with a self-stabilizing forward-looking infrared, FLIR, sensor, TV and laser rangefinder, and dual-mode automatic tracking. The system is capable of automatic range and envelope determination as well as fire control and second fire capability at the same target. The platoon command post is also based on the Wiesel II vehicle. In response to the current security situation, the German army has deployed the Ozelot short-range self-propelled air defense system in Lithuania this week. The Ozelot, Wiesel II air defense weapon carrier, is built on a small Wiesel II armored vehicle. The Ozelot carries two box launchers containing four FIM-92 Stinger surface-to-air missiles that are ready to fire but can also be armed with IGLA, Mistral, and IGLA missiles. LFK Ing, RBS-70 MK-2 or Starburst. Ozelot can be transported by helicopter CH-53. An army platoon will be equipped with an air defense platoon command post and typically between five and eight Ozelot air defense weapons platforms. Germany continues to strengthen the Allied capabilities of the Lithuanian Forward Presence Battle Group. Lithuania has asked allies to add more troops and equipment after Russia's invasion of Ukraine. The deployment, which will also include more troops from the United States and the Netherlands, is separate from troops arriving for military exercises that Lithuania will host in March. The deployment and training will increase the number of foreign Allied troops in Lithuania to 4,000. The Lithuanian Multinational Battalion Fighting Group is based in Rukla and is led by Germany.